We always use red roses for our pachamama. She, in when we make our despachos, we always use red flowers to signify, to represent the divine feminine and Pachamama. And then I have the white flowers because they represent our apus. They always rec represent the masculine polarity, so we always have them in balance. In the Andes, we are always harmonizing. It's never lopsided. We're not going more one than the other. We're always working with the Yenantan Masintan energy of um, complementary dualism, harmonizing the polarities. And in so doing, this is the work that we're doing, is also harmonizing the polarity between the mind, the ego mind and the heart. Not to discount the mind and throw it out and throw it away because it's so important, but to start being led from the heart mind rather than from the ego mind, which is a very, very powerful place to be, isn't it? When, we, when we're in that place, we're very clear with our decisions, we trust our intuition, um, manifestation happens effortlessly, things open up for us. So celebrating all of that today and calling more of that in for our um, sacred path and our journey.